This is the story of a person named Theseus who was destroyed because of his own fatal flaw. It all started when Theseus learns that he is the son of King Aegeus. Once he realized who his father was, he went on a quest, a quest that would prove his strength and abilities, but a quest that eventually let his greatest weakness consume him. On this quest, he completed many obstacles. One of these was to defeat a giant named Sinus. Theseus defeated him with the method that Sinus used to defeat others. He tied him to two trees and then let go, allowing Sinus to be ripped in half. Another obstacle was an innkeeper named Procrustes. Theseus also used Procrustes' method to kill him. He put him on a bed. Since he was too tall, Theseus cut off his feet. Since he was still too tall, Theseus cut off his head and threw his body into the sea. Then King Aegeus' wife, a witch named Medea, attempted to poison Theseus, but he evaded that as well. Eventually, Theseus had to overcome the labyrinth and defeat the Minotaur. He was very successful, but he forgot to change the sails on the ship as he was going home. So King Aegeus, believing that Theseus was dead, jumped into the sea and killed himself. After this, Theseus becomes king and had many victories. All of this opened a door for his greatest weakness to destroy him. During the time that Theseus was victorious, his friend Parathaus came to him asking for his help. He needed help marrying a woman who was already married to Hades. Hades was the god of the dead and lived in the underworld. Despite the risk of this adventure, Theseus agreed to help his friend because his weakness prevented him from doing otherwise. So the two of them traveled to the underworld. When they got there, they told Hades about his friend's intention to marry his wife. Hades says that they should talk it over and has Theseus and Parathaus sit on a bench. Once they sit on it, they realize that the bench is magic and that they will be stuck on it forever. While they, for, while they are forever stuck on the bench, they are stung by furies while a three-headed dog gnaws at their fingers and toes. They predic their predicament is a result of Theseus's fatal flaw, his pride. His pride led to his downfall and caused him to be stuck in the underworld forever. That is the story of someone named Theseus, a person consumed by pride.